Let's graph the equation x equals zero. So think of it this way, x is always equal to zero. So let's just put some zeros in here for x. And no matter what value we have for y, x equals zero. So if we said y was zero, x would be zero. If y was three, x would be zero, because x equals zero. If y was negative three, x would be zero. So these are the points we can plot for the graph of x equals zero. So zero, zero, that's right there at the origin. X is zero, y is three, and we said x is zero, y is negative three. And so let's put a vertical line through this. And then we can put arrows to show that this goes to infinity. So any value we put in for y, it's gonna be on this line here. I just chose these because they fit on the graph paper. If you had x equals a number, something like x equals seven, that would mean that you'd go over to x equals seven and you'd have a vertical line. If you had x equals negative seven, the vertical line, that would be over here. But in this case, since we had x equals zero, that was just here. At x equals zero, we draw our vertical line on our graph. This is Dr. B with the graph for x equals zero. Thanks for watching.